Top 9 Amazing Villages in Switzerland Switzerland has long been known for its breathtaking scenery and delicious cuisine and majestic beauty of the Alps. Though small compared to its neighboring countries, Switzerland has so much to offer for all types of travelers. The best way for visitors who are seeking an authentic Swiss experience, getting to know the locals and enjoying the awe-inspiring nature that the country is known for should seek out the tiny villages nestled high in the mountains. So in this video, we will discuss the top 9 amazing villages in Switzerland. But before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. Number 9. Grimans The picturesque Valais village of Grimans at an altitude of 1,564 meters belongs to the municipality of Anaviers in the eponymous valley. A tour of the village reveals all its charms, and the burger house from 1550 forms the center of the village. In its cellar, a white glacier wine matures in old larch wood barrels, a specialty of the nomadic farmers of the past. Historically, this wine was only served if the bishop came to visit during the year. The skiing area ranges up to an altitude of 3,000 meters in the winter. The offerings are complemented by a fun park, guided tours, cross-country ski runs, a toboggan run, and winter hiking trails. Number 8. Zermatt Zermatt in southern Switzerland's Valais Canton is a mountain resort renowned for skiing, climbing, and hiking. The town, at an elevation of around 1,600 meters, lies below the iconic, pyramid-shaped Matterhorn Peak. Its main street, Bonhostrasse, is lined with boutique shops, hotels, and restaurants and has a lively Ypres ski scene. There are public outdoor rinks for ice skating and curling. Zermatt is known for its Ypres ski activities, which include tea dances, restaurants, bars, nightclubs, and discos. It has more nightclubs than any other resort in the Valais. Number 7. Morco Morcote is a municipality in the Swiss canton of Ticino situated about 10 kilometers from Lugano in the district of Lugano on the shore of Lake Lugano. During the late Middle Ages, the major industries of Morcote included fishing, farming, and shipping. During the end of the Middle Ages, artists began to move into the town as well. In 1583, the town had a self-supporting parish established in the parish church Santa Maria del Sasso, which dated from the 13th century. Number 6. Thun the city's most famous landmark is the mighty Thun Castle, with its tower that was built between 1180 and 1190, which towers majestically over the old town. Thun is a town near Lake Thun in Switzerland's Bernice Oberland region. Turreted Thun Castle from the 1100s stands on a hill of the old town. It has sweeping views of the Alps. The 14th century city church has an octagonal tower and a Baroque hall. Thun Panorama in Lakeside Shadow Park is a 19th century, 360 degree painting of the town. Paddle steamers cruise Lake Thun to the resort town Interlaken. Number 5. Stein am Rhein. Stein am Rhein is a small town west of Lake Constance, Bodensee, in northeastern Switzerland. It's known for its preserved, half timbered medieval houses with painted facades clustered around Raffausplatz in the old town. On the banks of the Rhine River, Street George's Abbey is a former Benedictine monastery complex with a museum. On a hilltop overlooking the town, Hohenklingen Castle dates back to the Middle Ages. Number 4. Lauterbrunnen Lauterbrunnen Valley is one of the most popular destinations in Switzerland, boasting glacial waterfalls, hiking trails, ski slopes, dramatic cliffs, and quaint villages. This stunning destination is the gateway to the Jungfrau region, and it's often referred to as the Valley of 72 Waterfalls. Lauterbrunnen is a village and municipality in the Interlaken over Hasli administrative district in the canton of Bern, Switzerland. The municipality comprises the other villages of Wengen, Murren, Gimmelwald, Steckelberg, and Eisenfla, as well as several other hamlets. Number 3. Kandersteg Kandersteg is a high-altitude resort village in the Bernese Oberland region of Switzerland. Trails like the challenging Almenalp and a cable car head east to Lake Oceanen. Set at the foot of the Blue Lasalt Massif, the lake is also a popular ski area as is Sunbuhl to the southwest. In the forested Blasi Nature Park to the north, Blasi is a small trout-filled lake fed by subterranean springs. Number 2. Brains Breens is a village on the northeast shore of Lake Breens in Switzerland's Bernese Oberland region. The village's 18th century wooden chalets and the sculptures dotted throughout the village are testimonials of a woodcarving tradition. North. A steam train runs up Brienza Rothorn Mountain, with views of the lake and surrounding Alps. East of Brienz, the Ballenberg Open Air Museum offers glimpses of rural life. Number 1. Spies Imagine a beautiful small town located on the edge of a lake with a majestic castle in the center of it. Yes, Spies is a perfect example of a small town on the edge of Lake Thun with a beautiful castle 
in the center of it. The village offers spectacular views of the mountains while you can take a stroll around the lake. You can also take a boat ride in the lake to witness the natural beauty around you. The village also has some of the finest vineyards, breathtaking scenery, an old age church, and a castle. And while you are here, do not forget to visit the 1,000-year-old church in the Spies Castle. Thus, Spies is among the beautiful villages near Zurich that you must visit. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this, make sure to like the video and hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next video.